Hi Richard, uh, hi Richard, uh, welcome to another YouTube video. I'm going to review this. The Casio, Casio electronic keyboard from Casio, as you can see, is a CT, CTK7110. It has USB, it has a three step lesson computer with scoring, and it has a separate left and right buttons, and it has a speaking feature, keypad controls, and it has buttons plus and minus so you can move around. Separate tone and rhythm and tone separate tone and rhythm buttons and tone bank and piano bank. You demonstrate you demonstrate by pushing both of these at the same time. Multifunction L C D instead of L E D with animation that animates the notes and the beats and the name of the title up there. That's a menu system that you can set the menus. Volume control is a slider. That is a push button unlike the, uh, like the other one that I reviewed previously. Power mode button standard on Casio keyboards of this era. And the song bank, song bank rhythm controller it has three buttons. It has fill in, synchro, and start and stop tempo button and it has a microphone input with volume. It has two stereo speakers with bass booster and it has a hundred rhythms features pops, dance funk and uh, rock jazz. You can read that and European, Latin, various without drums Drum and bass and metronome, which is not really considered a rhythm, but that's a drum sequence. 142 tones, which has piano, which features piano, carmatic percussion category, and it has bass category, it has star STR orchestra and a somber category, brass and C flat, stint pad, and it has layers category, and it has a split category, and it has a GM tone, I don't know what that GM stands for, and drum set. This is the song bank it has, it has the Lion King theme, it has the Happy Birthday, and among others that you can read. This is the other list. I'm not going to read them all because you can pause the video at your door. People on YouTube if you want to find out. And there's the other more of them. And there's the last 50 from the song bank. This is the piano only uh, section. It only plays piano, doesn't play drums and bass. And here's the uh, other side. I'm not going to read them because you understand what they are. And piano thing. And the user page, usernames, whatever they are, these are the various different versions of the song I suppose. Line the number again and there's the layout of the keys. And here is the, the you can see, I don't know if you can see it or not, but there is there's little labors here. To tell you what the keys do in drum mode and what the chord keys do. There's a G, C, C sharp, D, E flat, E sharp, E flat, F flat, F2 is this. And I uh, F2, that's not really, it was late to that, it's not too. And F sharp, G, so forth, so forth.
it ends here. And my Yamaha has this is a chart a, a chord key. I keep on, but this one is this one ends here. And it splits it. Here is the ports of the machine. You have headphone output. Headphone output right there if you can see it. DC input and a sustain pedal input. And you have a USB port, standard USB port for hooking up to your computer. This is what the bottom plate looks like. The model number and the battery information. You want to read it with you. And this is the data plate. Who made it? This plate is how you access the keys. So you can clean it. Get your battery compartment. So you can insert your double A's batteries. Goes to the adapter. This adapter did not come with it. But it, uh, it came with the other keyboard, but it works with this one. Here's this Casio's standard adapter plug for this keyboard. It's a 12 volt adapter. I believe it's got a negative center pulse priority. Has negative, like most electronics are. Seems like most of them in this room are. I'll plug it into the main power port in the back. Oh, it doesn't say Casio on the back, but the other one does. This is more like, more advanced. I believe this one, the CTK7110, is a more advanced model than, than the previous one I've reviewed. The keys do not light up. I'm going to, have to I'm going to do a short thing because I only got a 10 minute time limit on this uh, recording. I like control. I turn that one up, I don't know why. Let's turn it on regular mode. This is the display coming up. You can hear it, as you can hear. Turn it off so you don't have to hear it. I'm pressing this key and it responds. You'll demonstrate a rhythm mode. Let's go to rhythm mode. Right now, set to that. Let's set it to 66 or Q. Casio cord is on. And now let's switch hands. I'm going to play a little piece of what I like to play. Let's start the rhythm. And play chord. I'm going to play one chord and that's it. You're going to hear the rhythm. Both speakers are going. And this display. This plays the beats per minute on the bottom. Watch the display for a minute and you can see it light up. <laughs>
have time to show you. That has been a review of the CTK1710 keyboard from Casio. From 1998, I believe. Alright, there you go.